<laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel, dude. Some crazy revolutions and revelations about the iPod Touch 7th generation. Man, we haven't talked about this in a minute. And I know a lot of people don't like me talking about it because before they were like, man, it's not going to come, this and that, dude. Let me just tell you guys that, you know what, possibly you could be right. But I also think and I also thought that they could bring it back. And apparently there's a whole nother set of rumors coming about that the iPod Touch 7th generation could possibly happen. Now, this is the iPod Touch 6th generation. And you can see it looks pretty outdated. It looks pretty much exactly like the iPhone 5. It's definitely slim though. I'll definitely give it that. It has the headphone jack on the bottom, lining port, all those things. A lot of things that we still probably won't use anymore. Now, the leak in and of itself actually that happened was from CES as far as I know. And there was an article that was published and they pretty much talked about, okay, there were these people that for some reason they have a hunch and they have like a thought that they heard from somebody or something that quite possibly Apple is working on an iPod Touch 7 generation. And they didn't really go into too many details, but they did say that it could bring USB type C. Now that is something that I don't think that Apple would ever do, but I could see them possibly bringing it. Now here's the thing that kind of brings me to them bringing it and them not bringing it. Okay. If they bring it, they're going to be getting rid of their proprietary lightning charger. Okay. Now this little port right here. Okay. This little port of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This has made Apple so much money. You guys don't even know. Okay. There's not a lot of people out there who can sell these legally. Now there's a lot of people who sell them illegally, like other companies, they make them and they just sell them on like eBay or something. But to get an actual Apple certified one, this is a proprietary one that will only work on iPods and you know iPhones and things like that. So Apple has made a killing on their lightning ports and I don't see them going to USB-C on their iPhones. I know they did it with their iPods. I know they did it with like their MacBooks and everything, but for them to bring it onto their iPhones, I don't know, dude, including their iPods. I think they kind of want to keep those things separate and eventually just have them keeping those. So people have to buy both a lightning charger and a USB-C type port because Apple's that type of person. They want to make even more money, but that's kind of my opinion. Okay. So that's kind of that aspect of it. And of course, they're probably what I'm thinking is they're going to bring that more iPhone 10 kind of look to it, but they're still going to keep it in that same body. That's what I'm thinking. Okay. They're going to keep it in the same body. They're going to push this out to the edges, maybe have a notch for the camera and everything like that. So what I'm also thinking is that not only they're going to do that, but they're also going to remove the headphone jack. Now that'll make perfect sense to me because Apple wants to kind of start going into that more music realm and they want to start getting people to you know, go into their more services route, getting into Apple music and also buying AirPods as well. That's what I, that's the whole entire thing that I'm thinking of. Why would Apple go and not try to upsell everybody? So I could see them maybe doing USB-C thing, but I think they're going to keep the lightning port, but they're definitely going to remove the headphone jack and make people buy the AirPods some when way or another. This is honestly what I think they're going to do. The same time they release AirPods 2, they're going to release the iPod Touch 7 Gen. They're going to make it some type of service route. They're not going to make it have like 100 billion gigabytes inside so you can store more music in it or something. They're going to make it so you can actually have maybe access to streaming everywhere in the world without a mobile plan or something. That's what I'm thinking they're going to do honestly. It's kind of a stupid thing I know, but Apple's really trying to make people have access to Apple Music and everything because they make a lot of money off that. And they also make a ton of money off the AirPods. So I think this year they're going to focus more on their music route in terms of the AirPods and iPods. And honestly, I think it could bring a, a comeback this year. And that's pretty much it. That's all we've really seen this year so far. I've seen a lot of other leaks. I, some people DM me on Instagram. They were like, oh, look at this thing that iTunes is telling me. It's telling me I have an iPod Touch 7 Gen. And I don't know why that's still the case. I see a lot of things like that. It could be just a glitch. It could be an actual coming. I don't know. But that's pretty much where we're at right now in terms of the leaks of the whole entire thing. So if you guys have any questions or anything like that, leave it down in the comment section below. Let me know. Do you guys think the iPod Touch 7 Gen is coming? I want to hear your guys' opinion on it. I honestly do think it will come, but it's going to be a little bit different than what everyone's thinking, including me. So that's pretty much where that leaves us, man. Hit that like button. That don't mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So it don't mean so much if you guys can hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my second channel, all those links are linked down below. I would really appreciate if you guys could check it out. But more importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, Dylan.